Hi everyone. Good morning. I'm just drinking my coffee. By the way, my burn is not gone away yet. If you guys have any tips on how to get rid of burns, I did this when I, I actually was cooking. I finished cooking and then after I was done cooking and I was cleaning, like 30 minutes later, the pan was still hot and that's how I hurt myself. Okay, so I'm gonna go over my hair real quick. Whenever you sleep, you always make sure you have a hair bonnet on. Everything I talk about is gonna be listed in my bio in my Amazon favorites. So whenever you go to sleep, you wanna make sure you have a hair bonnet on. Some are too tight, some are too loose. Your hair density, everything is gonna matter when it comes to your bonnet. So just keep getting them. If the one that I recommend you don't like, keep going, just keep buying. That's what I love about Amazon is you can just buy a bunch of them and then return the ones you don't want, you know? So you always wanna make sure that you sleep with a hair bonnet. And my best advice is the same advice I have for sunscreen. The best sunscreen is the sunscreen you're going to wear every day. The best hair bonnet is the bonnet you're gonna wear every night. So you just wanna make sure that you like it and it works for you, okay? So this is what I did the other day. So I wash my hair about once a week. You wanna do that because by shampooing your hair and getting your hair wet, you're changing the pH balance and it's actually making your hair dry. And that's what makes your hair like brittle. So I used to be under the impression of when my hair felt brittle, I was like, oh, I need to wash my hair because I have to put conditioner on it. It's not the case, okay? So um, your hair is dry because you're not bringing the sebum that's at the root down to the ends, which are dry and need it the most. So I'm gonna go over um, my hair brushing techniques for dry and wet hair. I'm gonna go over the oil I'm using and I'm gonna go over the inversion technique, which I've been doing. Okay, so the inversion technique is essentially you massage your scalp and then you flip upside down and the blood goes um, into your scalp and it's scientifically proven that it makes the blood vessels in your scalp actually contract and bigger. So you wanna do it for four minutes a day. And you can do it for four minutes a day for one week per month. If you do it too often, it will actually make your body used to it. And then you will not get those rapid hair growth um, techniques. Like you, it won't work for you because your body will be used to it. So. The reason this works so well is because it kind of shocks your system because you're not used to being upside down. So when your hair is wet, you want to make sure that you use like a wet brush. So I used to use an actual, like it's called wet brush, but now I use the Fremar and I really like, wait, Fremara? Wait, Fremar? Is that how you say? I don't even know. Um, but I really like it. I got three of these. I got in purple, pink, blue. So when your hair is wet, you want to make sure that you only use a wet brush that's designed for wet hair. You always start at the bottom and then you go up like that, okay? So you wanna do that because you wanna make sure that your hair is detangled. I only use a wet brush like this when my hair is wet. So, and you wanna be really, really gentle with your hair. You don't wanna be aggressive with your hair. You wanna be very, very gentle with your hair, okay? Treat your hair like the finest silk. All right, so then, um, so I only use this when my hair's wet. My hair's not wet right now. So what do I use? My hair is dry. I This is from Mason Pearson. This is um, a boar hair brush. It's mixed, so it's boar hair, and it's also nylon. And I have this in three sizes. Um, so you start at the bottom again, and you go like this. Make sure you get all the tangles out. So what the boar hair brush is doing is it's actually taking the oil from your scalp and it's dragging it all the way down to the ends. So when you use it, you wanna make sure that you're always, it's always touching your scalp and going down like this. And what I do at night is I actually will, um, I'll uh, put my hair into sections, I'll put it in like four or five sections and then I'll go from the root and I'll go down like that. Mochi, Yuki. Diane, really wealthy, every stop. Once you stop too. All right, so I do that. Um, and you really, like, you can really tell when you're dragging the sebum down to the ends. You can, like, you can physically see that your hair 
is becoming softer and more manageable and like just shinier. I was actually Googling like is something wrong with me because I felt like I wasn't producing enough oil and then as soon as I started using um, a diamond stop, as soon as I started using a boar ha hair bristle brush again or like using it correctly because I've actually had this for years I just wasn't using it correctly. I realized like my hair is just so much better and I can actually tell that my scalp is producing oil and the oil is moving where before I feel like I wasn't doing anything to my scalp so I feel like the oil was kind of just like blocked up so now that I'm actually doing this I can actually feel the oil moving which I'm not sure leave me a comment if you've ever had that happen because I really was like googling I was like is something going on like why can't I like because my hair, when I wash it, like it didn't feel oily. And I was like, why does my hair not feel oily? It's because it was like trapped. Okay, so the inversion technique is like once your hair is all, you know, good like that, you want to use an oil. So I, this is the Jamaican black castor oil. And I got this on Amazon. It's listed above. And then this is the Hairfinity Advanced Hair Care. So I got both of these on Amazon and I really like them. Now, you want to do the inversion technique for seven days, and you don't want to wash your hair every day because washing your hair is really bad. So, you want to use oil, but you don't want to, like, take a ton of oil. Just take your hand like this and just put a little bit of oil on your fingers, and then go like this, and then massage your scalp. See, I just used a tiny bit. Now, you can do it again if you want, so just use a tiny bit like that. And you can use as much or as little as you want. You just want to make sure you're not washing your hair every day. So you don't want to get your hair like greasy or too oily that you feel like you have to wash it. So you go like that, okay? And you can do it on your whole scalp. And then when I use this one, what I do is you can do that, the technique I just showed, or you can just, oh, Jesus, oh my God, I just spilled my oil, no! Jesus. Oh my god, I just spilled my oil. Okay, well, I'm gonna use a ton of oil now because I just spilt it everywhere, so I can't let that go to waste. Okay, so what I will do... Oh my god, I can't believe I just did that, guys. I just spilled so much oil. Well, whatever. It's not going to waste. I'm gonna put it on my hair right now. Um, But you just want to take a little bit and put it all on your um, your scalp. So I'll take that, I can't believe I just did that, the, um, the bottle thing, and I'll like put it um, just like one. Okay, so I do that. And then what I do is I'll just lay on the couch, like watching TV, and I'll use my hands and I'll use this. This is also listed above. It's This is for like when you shampoo your hair, but you can also use it when your hair is dry. And once again, you just want to make sure that you're like, hi Diamond, that you're not doing it like too aggressively. And you're just going to go like that on your scalp. And like, you can do this for like five minutes. I literally have just been sitting and watching TV and like doing it. And look at my hair. Like, I just feel like my hair is so much better and like more alive and like it just feels good. Okay, so I do that. So then, set your timer for four minutes. You take your hair like this. And you just like literally have your hair down for four minutes and you want to make sure your head is like all the way so like all the hair is going and all the scalp I'm not gonna like do it for four minutes right now for you guys but I've been doing that every day and my hair honestly feels so good and even if you can't flip upside down just give yourself a massage and my god are you gonna just feel good all right so this is like my hair check-in I washed my hair three days ago and I use, I've been using oil on it every day. And yeah, I've also been using the K18. And um, so a check-in with the K18 is I've actually been using um, way more K18. Like I got the big bottle and I got the big spray that are like the professional use ones. I got them on Etsy um, and they are working so good. So before I washed, or after I washed my hair last time, I spritzed my hair with like, I sprayed it down with the spray bottle and then I used a ton. Like they say use a little bit. I used so much and my hair felt so good. I didn't need to condition after. I just, I used a leave-in like spray. All right. Love you guys.